Hello and welcome back to the SCSP community channel. Today we are going to be looking at another tool and the tool that we are going to be looking at is this one right here, Meltego. Now Meltego comes pre-installed on Kali Linux. So you can just go ahead and click this logo and it will start running or you can also go ahead and open the terminal and type in Meltego. Right now, a little bit about this tool. Uh, Meltego is an OSINT tool that is different than other tools. Where it's because of its um, presentation, I would say, the way it presents its targets, and it sort of lays lays out the whole, um, you'd say, the structure in a graphical way, and that's what makes Meltego um, so unique than other tools. Right, so without further ado, uh, let's begin, shall we? Now, in order to start with Miltego, what we're going to do is we're just going to create a new graph. So, uh, this is the new graph that we've created. Now, we are going to start off. What you're going to do is we're just going to drag and drop the domain right um, drag and drop the domain now mm, this is how basically um, Meltego is set up so we're going to just going to define our target that we want uh, the information for so I'm just going to go with Dropbox right and now what we're simply going to do is Meltego works on transforms. Now what these transforms are are basically um, they're different modules that you can use um, and gather information. So if I wanted to do a um, name server search right for Dropbox.com, so you're just going to click that and then it starts running. And there you go. These are all the different name servers, um, AWSDN, Amazon. So this is where um, Meltego is so different. Is it just gives you, like I said before, it pays you a very clear and clean and cut picture of how an organization is set up. So what else can we do? Um, we can also have a look at let me go ahead and <clears throat> let's just go ahead and have some email addresses right we're going to do email addresses and here on the top right you can move the so we've got different email addresses as well now and you can move around with the on the store uh, with this window on the top right and you can basically see like all these different um, uh, emails here that we've got. Now you can also run transforms on these um, different uh, different uh, subclasses that I would like to call right so you can go ahead and do a phone number search uh, URL or website or verify the email address myspace account so you can do all these different things and it is basically like a jack of all when it comes to OSINT right and I don't think there is any other tool that compares to Meltego now the another Another thing that I would like to mention is that this is a community edition that I'm using. There are also paid versions of this. So you can go ahead and buy like a paid version and it will probably come with um, added functionalities that community edition doesn't have. So um, let's do a, uh, let's see, phone number search. No. Keep, keep in mind that the tool itself is amazing, but it only gathers information that it is available publicly, right? 
it is not doing something out of the uh, ordinary right it's only gathering information that's out there and just putting it in front of you right so i guess uh, there was no phone number or is yeah there was no phone number for this person so basically the point is that you can just keep expanding the graph as you uh, move along and so we can do like file search as well so let's just do that um, what else uh, you can either go to all to make all transforms and we can do a phone number search for Dropbox let's see <clears throat> what else we'll just keep uh, running different transforms and see how this is actually set up okay mail server search so show different mail servers so you have to use this window on the top right as I said before to move around a bit and yeah so this is uh, basically Meltalo and this is why uh, this tool is so unique so that'd be it for this video uh, hope you like the video if you did uh, please leave a like and do subscribe to the channel and also uh, leave a comment if you have any suggestions for us see you in the next video